All right, here we are, son. We're gonna take out some fucking criminals. Smooth fucking criminals. Because we are police, uh, lieutenant? I don't know his fucking rank. Dukota, son. That's kind of like that state, Dakota. And it's like, uh, rookie, there are two cities or states by the name of Dakota. And he's like, ugh, this is my first day on the job. His first day on the job, he's already a lieutenant? This is a desperate fucking police station, son. They don't just fuck around. They promote people right in the door. They're like, we have six people on the force, so you're lieutenant. Enjoy it. Everyone else works a desk job, so get out there and shoot fuckers to death with a gun. And he's like, can do. I've been training for years. And by that, I mean three weeks at the police academy. And they're like, oh, like that humorous movie? And he's like, in no way, shape, or form. Michael Winslow was not present to make funny sound effects. And I was quite disheartened. They're like, was the guy that played, um... Who was the main dude in Police Academy? Uh, Mahoney? Nobody remembers him. He's not High Tower or Sound Effects Man or where the fuck am I supposed to go? Um, who else is in Police Academy? If you were, I mean, just in passing, if you happen to know any of the other main characters of Police Academy, then comment section. And Bobcat Goldthwait doesn't count. I'm talking about the first one. Goddamn. Well, I've discovered you can run around in little loops so look how professionally he walks so I take this shit seriously also tan pants and a, a blue shirt are you a deputy sheriff or are you a city uh, fucking police officer make up your mind I don't care what time period this is set in son you gotta make that uniform uniform that's the very fucking definition of the word also these guys aren't fucking around well I guess they are fucking around because I killed oh look I could just jump up there all along. Oh, it's, a, it's like a sealed door mystery. It's murders in the Moulin Rouge. How is it like that at all? Shut up, naysayer guy who's a split personality of my own. Okay. Apparently you get like a Gundam thing in this game, but I don't notice it right now. All I notice is that I'm a loose cannon can't... Loose cannon cop who plays by his own rules. Also, I have to shoot down a helicopter with a pistol? It's this fucking Call of Duty? Do I get a quick time event? Huh? Is Price gonna come in and fucking slide me a gun and be like, Soap, give them, up them apples, Soap, give them a the bums rush, eh? Soap, where's my sifter of brandy? And Soap's like, what the fuck is a sifter? And he's like, oh, damn it, Soap. Yo, just credit to the fourth. Why am I making so many Call of Duty references in this video? Jesus Christ, the fucking helicopter's legs! It's an amorphous... Charles Darwin, I blame you! Son, look at Billy and them coveralls, son. He ain't gonna take no shit from nobody. Son, look at that. Look at that fucking punching technique. He threw the shit out of that putty. My God. It never stood a fucking champ. Oh, you mess with the wrong motherfucker. Billy will gut you like a fucking crawdad. You have no idea. The world of shit you have opened when you fuck with Billy. Look at that punching stance. The perfect combination of a flawless defense and a 
fucking massive offense. It's like a tiger driving a semi truck directly into your fucking asshole. Billy will grab a hold of you, son, and he will shake you like a fucking baby, and you will die. Hey, trench coat man, how you doing? <gasps> Putties in disguise, Billy. Look at that! My God, he's fucking savage. From fucking Final Fantasy VI, it, the the pummel blitz is the first one he learned to use in the beef Vargas. Oh, son, busting through shop windows. Vandalism, Billy won't stand for it, son. He is running to fucking form a town committee. He's gonna fucking he's gonna defeat you the only legal way he knows, and that's with fucking legislation. By legislation, that's the slang for his fucking fist. Look at that shit, son. Billy Jean is not my lover. Alright. Look at that. They're fucking pitiful. Them gray putties. They must have like uh fucking um what's that disease? Osteoporosis? Is that even a disease or is it a condition? What's the difference? I need House MD son here to clean this shit up. But hey, Billy ain't got no time for no metal diagnosis, no, son. He's gonna run his ass to the end of the street. Beat shit out of everyone he encounters. There's no fucking stopping him. My God. I'm not even touching the controller. He's, he's fucking so fucking in tune with beating the shit out of these putties that the AI of the game has took over. I'm sitting here dumbfounded. Every time you hit Billy, he goes that much anger. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's fucking Skeleton Man, Skeleton Red Mage Man. Looks like it's fucking morphin time. God, Billy got buff. Motherfuckers! Dream Super Fucking Combo! You ain't nothing to Billy. You are like a gnat, a f gnat fart in the wind! You might as well try to fight Hurricane Fucking Hugo. Once that Hurricane Hugo happened 20 something fucking years ago, doesn't matter. Billy envisions it. He's a blue, refreshing spring breeze on a hot summer day. Spring Breeze is the first game of Kirby Superstar, which is a game I should have played instead of this one. I mean, fuck all of you. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh oh, Billy. Look, dropping the bombs. Speaking of bombs, check this shit out. It ain't nothing. It ain't nothing. You are the sweat that runs down Billy's ass crack when he's beating the shit out of all your loved ones. You ain't nothing. Billy will come to you in your sleep right Freddy fucking Cougar and he will murder you to death. And it won't matter. There ain't a cord in the land that'll convict Billy. Be like, your honor, my client, Mr. William J. Does Billy have a last name? Mr. William J. The Beauregard here. Uh, I declare a writ of bad attitude and the judge is like, I'll allow it. Also, in this instance, it's the judge from Phoenix, right? So, he's even more ridiculous than usual. My god, I'm not even paying attention. Throwing park benches? I don't even have to. Son, my, there's no fucking stopping him. There isn't. It would take, let's see, the combined efforts of Solid Snake, Dante, who else? Uh, Perfect Cell. Mmm, they, they couldn't stop Billy. They could slow Billy down for two, three minutes. You'd have to add... Fucking Hollywood Hulk Hogan. Who else would have to get in on this equation to even touch Billy? Uh, who's a popular action star right now? Vin Diesel, no. Uh, uh, Lawrence Fishburne? Did you, did you even hear what I asked? Never mind. Needless to say, Hollywood actors can't touch Billy. What Billy brings to the table is, is true in form. It's no Hollywood magic. There are no wires attached to Billy. And his side staff? What is that? Is it a trident? He can spin the shit out of it, whatever it is. If you know what Billy Weapons is, leave it in the comments. Alright, Skeleton Dave, time to put you in, back in your fucking grave. He's like, nah, you'll never defeat Tamir in my rapier. And Billy's like, it's more of a saber, really. And he's like, oh, damn you and your knowledge of martial weaponry. You shan't defeat me in the feather in my cap. I shall call it macaroni. And Billy's like, eat a bomb, bitch. Triceratops, motherfucker. Look at that. It gave him fucking Parkinson's. He's like, nah. I shall hang out with Michael J. Fox. And Billy's like, that joke's in poor taste. He's like, nah, you'll never defeat me in my terrible jokes that Family Guy might make in passing, but I make with true sincerity. Oh, you son of a bitch. You made Billy mad. 
Billy fucking Mays in his prime. Look at that. Blown you to bits. He's like, I have no arms, but I shall defeat you. And Billy's like, you ever read the novel Fair Way to Arms? Because it'd be fucking ironic. And he's like, oh, Billy, your literary knowledge is quite vast. But can you defeat me? I'm the hopping fucking Hessian, and I'll jump all about the screen. Sit still, you son of a bitch. I'll fucking kill you. Billy fucking Madison. And he's like, an Adam Sandler movie has nothing to do with this situation. And Billy's like, fuck you, son. I'm all over you. Um... What are some other Billies? Oh, now he's just ahead. Billy's like, trying to get ahead in life. And he's like, your silly Austin Powers ripoff punch can defeat me. I have skeleton power. I'm like that motherfucker from Nightmare Before Christmas. And Billy's like, you mean the king of Halloween, the pumpkin king? Fucking, uh... What's his fucking name, Jack Skeleton? He's like, meh. It seems your wikipedia esque knowledge has limitations, young William. Was this person even in Power Rangers? A fucking skeleton head? I don't even fucking care. Billy done rocked your shit, son. Alright, hang on to your fucking drawer, son, Ninja fucking Gaiden. I played this game previously and I suck dicks at it, but I eat my fucking Wheaties every morning and got up and fucking did sit-ups and shit, curl-ups, and uh, I threw up. I had fucking bulimia, son, and it better work, because not only is my figure, figure fucking fabulous, but I'm a ninjutsu fucking master. hoo You can't bust these cherry blossoms, baby. Ninja fucking guiding. It means a side story. Oh, I'm on fire! NBA Jam, motherfuckers! Charles Barkley! Touchdown, Thurman Thomas! Like, that's Tegma Bowl, you son of a bitch! And I'm like, who are you? Huh? Who's leaving comments now? Uh, Senor Del Fuego? Aren't you too busy liberating uh, Spanish villages to be leaving comments on my YouTube video? Hmm? Oh, look, took one bar of damage just to show the enemies that I'm mortal. All right, hockey stick man, how you doing? <gasps> boom, 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 boom. Oh, I'll send over here to my mighty shuriken. I'll take you down. Hot, see, pop, pop, badoken. It's what Ryu yells when he does a hurricane kick. I think. If you know what Ryu yells when he does a hurricane kick, leave it in the comments. Oh, look, a cutscene. Ryu's like, oh no, I'm Ryu Hayabusa. I think that's my last name. I haven't checked Wikipedia recently, and I have amnesia. And I'll look to the left. What's that? Oh, just a girl. And she's like, I'll have you know that women uh, have progressed greatly since the release of this game. Thank you very much. And hold a equal standing in society. And by equal, I mean they can equally put fucking bullets in you. And then she shoots the shit out of him. Look at him. He's like bitches and hoes. All right. Jack 2, Ryu wakes up after getting shot by a bitch, and he's like, I will take my anger out on all Jason Voorhees looking motherfuckers with baseball bats. Also, the flow of the game was ruined because I couldn't cut one fucking candle. What are those dogs made of? Why are, are boxers walking around trying to kill me? Fucking bats? Really? Are there trained bats in this warehouse thing that I'm in? Whatever the hell this is? Oh, windmill shuriken! Oh shit, son, my kung fu is strong. And they're like, kung fu has nothing to do with ninjutsu. And I'm like, they're both Chinese, Japanese, dirty knees, look at these. If you know which particular Asian culture kung fu and ninjutsu hail from, leave it in the comments, baby. Son, we're gonna have a discussion ideals. Wah! But she was strong. So pronounce she or Kai, baby. Who knows? Woo! This is poorly laid out. It's an OSHA fucking nightmare. Got to jump up fucking ladders and shit. Oh, but I'm Ryu Hayabusa, son. I ain't got. A, I ain't part of no union, son. Ryu Hayabusa rolls his own way. Hua, hua, hua. 
Huh, I can't be fucking stopped. My god, is there any force in this world that can kill me? Well, people can hit me and maybe go when flying in a direction. Alright, now we're outside, which means there's gonna be green guys throwing crucifixes at us. Woo! Don't take the Lord's name in vain, baby! Don't take the goddamn motherfucking Lord's name in vain, you piece of shit. My god, this shuriken will never stop following me until I pick up a different power up, but that don't count. Whoosh. Uh, fun fact, game pro tip, power move. If you jump down that pit, you die, but if you climb down a ladder, you live. They sleep some, but I live. Oh, I'm on fire, NFL Blitz. Actually, I don't know if they use that term in NFL Blitz. Uh, NBA Jam 2, Tournament Edition. Woo! Alright. Look at that, I got full fucking health, baby. Ain't no bat gonna stop me, not even the Batman. Oh, shit, son. Sinbad the Sailor was like, you talk shit about Batman, baby? Oh, God, crucifixes. Oh, the, the, the Curse of Montillado. The Curse of Montillado? That's not the name of that fucking classic. I can't kill him. Oh, I did. My determination. In my desperation, I struck out. You went up against a man who threw crucifix at you, and in his desperation, he turned towards someone he didn't understand. He had a ruby the size of a tangerine. <sighs> I can't impersonate Alfred. It gets me killed. All right, that was a warm-up. That was a past life. We've been reincarnated as uh, Kaiser Soze. <laughs> you didn't expect the usual suspects reference, did you? You stupid cocksucker. Damn. I apologize to everyone watching this video, except that one guy. You know you are. Fuck you. Oh, Machine Gun Kelly couldn't take me down. Oh, PK Fire! They're like, oh my god, he's fucking Smash Brothers reference. I'm like, Smash Brothers? Uh, more like Earthbound, aka Mother 2. Uh, perhaps you've heard of it. Alright, let's take this boss out with vats. And by vats, I mean very articulated uh, Taikanitsu Sumiyoshi. It's Japanese. It means I'm gonna cut you in my fucking katana. They're like, the word katana is Japanese and it's not even in that sentence. And I'm like, who are you? Uh, the world's foremost expert in Japanese language? Uh, I don't know who that would be. If, can you be an expert in a Japanese language? That doesn't make any sense. What if you're natively Japanese? It's cheating. It's like Game Shark in that shit. Alright, let's watch a little bit of cutscene. Ryu's like, oh, I've got to run quickly. These lines are flying by me in the background. Epileptic seizures. Who was that woman that shot me to death? And except I wasn't dead. I'm alive. Also, the game wants me dead. Alright. Now he's coming out of his fucking lo rustic log cabin. He's done making s'mores and drinking brandy. The s'mores go with brandy? Fucking cheetahs attacking me. Cheetahs are indigenous to this region. This game needs to do some fact checking. Oh, look at that. The hawk is mighty, but the wind is stronger. It's a proverb rather than a fortune cookie. Look at that. So fucking Father O'Malley O'Brien's uh, Sistine Chapel. Uh, uh, 12 Days of Hanukkah. Morimoto there. Why is <laughs> Japanese throwing fucking crosses at me? You hawk son of a bitch. All right. Look at this, son. I'm fucking solo in the game. It's like it's a one-player game. I'm like, really? Why am I cutting baby bald eagles to get items? Do baby bald eagles drop power-ups and shit? Will baby bald eagles make my ninjutsu strong? Because I will kill the fuck out of a baby bald eagle if my ninjutsu will get powered up. It's odd. <laughs> Can you believe I actually ran out of shit to say? Oh, windmill throwing star, bitches! He's like, fucking linebacker John there didn't give a shit. He's like, 32 blue height! Is there any rhyme or reason to the things they yell? Oh, you got your shit rocked and you fell in a pit. Alright, now that I died again, so let's take this shit out. Oh, what was I talking about? Football? You're shooting bazooka the shit at me, it ain't fair. He's like, play Ninja Garden on the Xbox, baby, talk about fairness. I'm like, touche, sir. You win this round. To the victor go the spoils. And he's like, what are the spoils? And I'm like, I won't kick you in the nuts. And he's like, it's a good day to die. <laughs> Apparently he's a unit from StarCraft. Sounds like a Klingon proverb. Woo. Oh, I, my, my Kung Fu arm was weak. They're like, once again, Kung Fu is not related to ninjutsu, you motherfucker. I don't care if Jack Black can use it when he's an anthropomorphic panda, but it ain't got shit to do with nothing. I'm thinking of Karate. Karate is Japanese, isn't it? I can't defeat him! He has modern technology! Oh god, a Vietnam War flashback. Jacob's Ladder?
Go, Ninja, go!